Hello, it's Jesse. I'm watching coming to you live and direct. And today we're talking about five shoes every man should own. Let's get into it. So let's start off with an honorable mention, and this goes to the running shoe. Now it's safe to assume every man owns a pair of running shoes in his closet. One thing I do want to touch up on though is that it has to be a versatile pair. So you have to be able to dress it down when you're not working out. Now my pair of choice is the Nike um, Air Rushes, and this is the fly knit pair. Um, I really, really love these. It's pretty much like I'm walking on air. So comfortable. But yes, this is what, um, when I'm not working out, I usually like to style these, you know, get my athleisure on. One thing I do recommend though is um, please don't get a pair of Air Monarchs or Steph Curry 3s because those are trash. But yes, let's get into my five shoes every man must own. So the first pair is the low cut white sneaker. Now this is a wardrobe essential for the spring and summertime. These come in different materials too, like leather. And a good example of a leather one is the um, classic Adidas Dan Smith. These are in canvas and these are Sperry Top Siders. Now I wear this all the time in the spring and summertime. Um, I've dressed them up with a shirt and tie and a suit before. And I also dress them down too casually. So yes, the first pair we have the low cut white sneaker. The second pair is the wingtip shoe. Now these I like wearing with a pair of suit. I also wear them casually. Sometimes I'll throw in a pair of jeans with chinos and a button down and you know, just wear them casually. So yes, number two, we have the wingtip shoe here. The third pair is the Chelsea boot. As you can see here, I have a brown suede pair in my hand, which I haven't worn yet. It's the winter time now and yeah, suede could be a pain in the ass to deal with. I have to treat it and you know, so I'm just waiting. I'm just waiting for the summertime to wear these. And in my left hand here, as you can see, I have a black leather pair. Now I really, really like the Chelsea boot. Like I said, you could, well, I haven't said that yet, but I like the Chelsea boot. You could dress it up, dress it down. And I really like the form factor on these. Easy to get on. You know, it has the, um, it has the um, elastic on the side here, which, you know, you pull onto the tab and slide your foot in. You're good to go. So yes, I will come out with a full video on the Chelsea boots, maybe how to style them. So yes, the third pair, we have the Chelsea boot. For the fourth pair, we have the loafer, in this case, the tassel loafer. Now, I like these because they're very comfortable. Unfortunately, I live in Canada, so I can only wear it when it's warm outside. But yes, really, really enjoy these. Actually, I need to get a pair of velvet loafers. But yes, the fourth pair, we have the tassel loafer. For the final pair, we have the dress boot. As you can tell, I have two pairs here. This is a cap toe pair and it has a rubber sole. I've been wearing this a lot this winter time because of the grip on the bottom and yeah, I've been wearing it casually, dressing it up, pretty much wear it almost everywhere. And this right here is a wingtip pair. I usually wear this with a suit. When I have a suit on, it pretty much covers it and it looks like a regular wingtip boot. So yes, so that's it for the five shoes every man should own in his closet. If you have these, you should have a very versatile wardrobe. My name is Jesse Abwaji once again. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to like this video, share it, and subscribe to my channel. Just show me love. Until next time.